Alright, so... This one's gonna take a bit of explaining to do why I like this game so much, but... Alright, so... One of the most famous things about Super Metroid is what we call sequence breaking. Now, what that means is when you get items out of order. So, I'm right here. You see me jumping. You see that door? Or, that blue door right there? So, the way you're supposed to get that, at least the way I used to do it always before, you know, I figured this out, is there's two enemies, and I already killed them, but you're supposed to freeze them with the ice beam. But instead, do a little bit of this. Probably gonna take me a few tries to get here. Because this is a really hard trick to do, especially when you have very little practice at it like I do. Alright, so, yeah. That is what we call the one wall wall jump. Now, I'm not gonna bother explaining how the one wall wall jump works, but... Uh, basically, you can use it to get items way earlier than intended. Now, I already got these items, so this isn't, like, the best example or anything. But right here, there are some missiles. And up here is a reserve tank and another pair of missiles. And also, I should mention, but to open this door, you need a super missile. Alright, see, there's the enemies right there. But, yeah, I'm never going to freeze them anymore. And, uh, yeah, so, basically, one of the reason, the main reason I like this game so much is the game rewards you for getting good at it. Now, let me just boost my incredibly unfilled ego and try to do it again, just to make myself feel good. Yep, alright, so, actually, fuck it, I'll explain how the wall jump works. So, uh... The way this works, it's kind of hard to understand the first time, but what you do, you spin jump, and then you hug the wall, and then, like, you press the opposite direction of the wall. The main way you'll know you do it right is that Samus here does a little animation pointing away from the wall. Now, it's not always perfect, it is kind of finicky, but if you've played this game as many times as I have and just take a little bit of time to get it down, you'll master the wall jump and end soon enough time Super Metroid. So, uh, yeah, there's my brief explanation of why I love this game so much.